Cement is the stuff that holds concrete together. Half of the emissions produced come from producing the heat required for the production process. The other half comes from just using limestone, the key feedstock for making cement. Limestone is calcium carbonate. When it's heated, 44% of its waste is released as CO2. Altogether, for every ton of cement produced, almost a ton of CO2 gets released. Cement is the second most consumed thing on Earth behind water. There's four billion tons of it produced a year. So when you take just the amount of CO2, 0.8 tons of CO2 per cement produced, and the fact that it's four billion tons per year, it's clear why that leads to 8% of the world's CO2 emissions coming from cement production. At a plant in California, CO2 emitted as exhaust from the cement manufacturing process is converted into a material that works just like cement. We really took our cues or our inspiration from nature. So the same way coral reefs form in nature and how shells form in nature, instead of emitting CO2, they're actually taking CO2, absorbing it, and creating a reactive form of limestone. If you talk specifically about our process, we're taking that same feedstock of limestone, we're putting it through a kiln, we're emitting CO2, but then we're recapturing that CO2 to make this form of reactive limestone. And we've engineered it in a way that it can be used both as a partial replacement to existing Portland cement or as a 100% standalone cement.